Hi everyone, and welcome to episode 143 of Saranova Crafts. I'm your host, Jessica. I can be found as Saranova on Ravelry and Twitter, and as Saranova Crafts on Instagram. You can find the show notes for today's episode if I remember to do them, because I'm in a bit of a hurry today, on my blog or on the Ravelry group. Links down below on YouTube if I get them done. Um, I'm in a bit of a rush today. Um, I, uh, But yeah, anyways, uh, if you're a new viewer, thank you for checking me out. If you are a returning viewer, thank you so much for coming back. Um, I know recording's been a little haphazard recently um, with being sick and then all this other stuff going on. And today, like I said, I'm in a little bit of a rush. So, um, yeah, I'm actually just going to tilt the camera down just a little bit. There we go. So I take up more of the screen. Um, and of course the cast drinker from the fountain and making lots of noise. Anyways, um, I do have a photo for you guys today and I have one whip, which is a test knit. So this is an open test knit, I think I can talk about it, so I'm just going to show you guys like the first piece I've knit real quickly, and I'll show you a picture of the pattern, but I won't um, show you anything else. Um, I am, the reason I'm in a rush is that I am going to Cleveland. Um, we're leaving in, in about six and a half hours, so um, we're leaving in about six and a half hours for Cleveland approximately which means I need to record this, edit it, post it, and take a nap and pack because we're going to be driving through the night so I need a nap. Um, the reason I'm going to Cleveland is I am going with 100 Ravens and we are going to TNNA. So if you are going to be there, come say hi. Um, I know it's more of an industry event than anything else. So, um, so you know, I'm, there probably won't be a lot of like people I would know, but you know, um, if, if you know who I am, I'll, I'll be at the 100 Ravens booth. Um, it's a hundred ravens. I'll be at their booth. Um, I'm going with them. We are driving because we have to haul the trailer and all that jazz. Um, but yeah, uh, uh, I've just been, I just had a crazy couple of weeks. So like my schedule got really thrown off. I'm going to try to go back to recording on Fridays, not this week, but next week. Um, so because this week, I'm, this Friday as in in two days, I'm going to be in Cleveland and, um, yeah, I'm not going to, I don't think I'm going to have time to record and upload a podcast while I'm there. I am going to try to take video while I'm there and I am going to try to maybe do like a vlog kind of thing of my experience, but we'll see. Um, it depends on how much Becca likes me having the camera out. Um, but anyways, uh, yeah, so I will just get right into the faux. Where did it go? I am sitting on it. That would be why. So I finished uh, my second brioche beanie. This one's a little smaller, but I did get it done. I thought I left the marker in for where I was. Ah, there it is. So last time I showed, so last episode I showed you guys it was there. So I finished knitting straight. Then I did the decreases. It's a little tighter than the other one. The other one's a lot um, baggier, but this still has a little bit of a slouch to it. Um, not as much of a slouch, but a little bit of a slouch. And I'm happy with how it turned out. So I'm happy with my green hat. You can see, here it is. Um, so I finished that. Um, so this was a lot of my knitting energy. And then, um, just put that there. Um, and then I started this test knit, which I'm keeping in my single strand studios bag. That's the Marauders map. Oh, I need to charge my camera. It's like flashing battery at me, but I should be able to finish. Um, so this is the first little bit I am doing. This is the first little piece. So yes, it's, it's a rectangle done on a diagonal. So there you go. Um, this skein of yarn in particular is Lammy Toes. You know, I honestly don't know if she's still dying. I haven't seen her update Etsy in ages and I kind of stopped watching her podcast because for, for like six months to a year, I just stopped watching video podcasts. Um, I continued listening to audio, but I stopped watching video podcasts, and I really need to go back and see what all the podcaster people I was following are doing now. Um, so I don't know if she's actually still dying, um, but this is Lammy Toes yarn. This is her Twinkle Toes sock base in her Winter J colorway. Um, it's, it's, so it's got a few speckles. I don't know if you can see the speckles on this camera right now. Oh, there you can see the speckles. There's a little bit of speckle. This sort of Winter J colorway. Um, this is what it looks like in the cake. Oh, there you can see the sparkle. See the sparkle? Yeah, there's sparkle. So that's the yarn. Super macro close up. Um, <laughs> uh, so, so yeah, um, I'm working on that. Um, I've actually started knitting something else out of this yarn. Hence why it's in the baggie and caked up. But, um, but then I ended up not doing that because I wasn't liking the pattern. So I changed it. Um, as for the pattern, this is from, um, 
This is from Abby Knits, who is the same one I did that hat for. Um, and this is the picture she shared of the pattern. So it's four colors. Can't really see it here, but I don't want to show anything else of the pattern. Um, oh, I will, sh I will show you um, a picture of her wearing it. So there's that. There it is there. Um, so that's what I'm knitting on. Uh, uh, I'm doing it as a test knit. Um, it's going fairly well so far. The due date is the end of July. So I have a bit of time, but I'm going to have some car time. So I'm planning to work on this in the car on the way to Cleveland. Um, or at least in the daylight hours on the way to Cleveland. Because if we're driving in the middle of the night, I'm not going to be able to see what I'm doing. But, so that's it, really. Um, super short episode for you guys. Super short check-in. But I just wanted to, to let y'all know I'm still alive and I'm doing okay. And um, life just kind of got away from me, unfortunately. Um, so, yeah. Uh, if you liked what you saw, uh, feel free to subscribe. Um, likes, comments, subscriptions are all very much appreciated on YouTube. It helps, it gives the algorithm some juice and helps more people find my podcast. Um, I'm still debating the whole vlog thing. If you have a comment about that, let me know. Oh, 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 also, um, before I forget to talk about this again, because I've been meaning for like four episodes to talk about this. Um, if you follow me on Instagram and or Twitter, you saw this week that I posted something about a Discord server. That's right, I made a Discord server for people who follow my podcast. Um, so if you want to join the Discord server, feel free. I will put a link in the description. It's a permanent link, it doesn't expire. Um, just come in and say hi. Um, I try to be on there. Um, I tend to leave Discord running while I'm at places and doing things. Um, like, I'm, like if I'm at work, I'll just have it on in the background. But, you know, just uh, just let me know. Um, also, uh, I did a Patreon. This is not a money grab. I swear, I swear, I swear this is not a money grab. Do not take it as that. But I decided that if people wanted and they were financially able to. You do not feel obligated about this at all. Let me make that perfectly clear. You do not have to give me any money. I promise this will be free forever. Unless I get popular enough that YouTube will put ads on the videos. But then it's still free to you, the person watching. Okay? Like, I'm not. Right? This is just... If you feel like giving me some love, go for it. If you don't want to, uh, don't have the money, um, I think it's weird that I'm asking, don't give me money. No skin off my back. I can pay my bills as it is, right? This is not a money grab, just to make this perfectly clear. But I did a Patreon. Um, there's a, I, now I put a, um, I put a channel in the Discord server that's just for people who decide to give me a tip on Patreon. Um, so yeah, if you want to do that, that would be great. If you don't, then I completely understand. Um, I'm still trying to decide what to do for people who do, um, who do support me on Patreon. Um, I'm thinking like videos or just quick things or like Google Hangouts uh, chats in the evenings or things like that. Um, if you have any suggestions actually, uh, let me know. I'd appreciate it. Um, so, but yeah, please, again, I'm going to reiterate, this is not a money grab. You don't owe me anything. If you enjoy watching my podcast and don't want to give me any money, that is totally fine. Trust me, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not begging here and I'm trying to make it perfectly clear that, that I'm not begging. Um, but if you like me and you want to give me some love, go for it. I'm not going to stop you. Um, so yeah, that's, uh, that's, that's what I have to say. Um, sorry if I try, if I was like really forced with the Patreon thing, but it's like, I don't want people to think I, they have to give me money. You don't. You do not have to give me money. I promise. This is not, if you want to, great. I will very happily have it. But if you don't, that's fine too. Just to make that clear. So anyways, with all that being said, I'm going to go. I need to go take a nap. Um, I just ate lunch and I'm actually getting a little sleepy. I can feel it. So if I go lay down now, I should be able to get a good two hour or so nap in. And I will process and upload once I'm awake because then I'll be packing and eating dinner and I can just have my computer running in the background while I do that. So, um, that's everything. If you've enjoyed this episode, again, thank you very much. Um, like, subscribes, comments, and, um, and if you didn't, sorry, it, I, there wasn't much knitting content this time around. There'll be more knitting content next time. Um, yeah, I think that's it. So, um, thank you all for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!